Hello, Internet. This is S.I.R. Mortinian with another episode of Ultimate Warrior. Last time, 3-1. 3-1 with the Rojack. That is not bad. I think that's similar, actually, to the start that I went with that Paladin uh, two arenas ago. Not the Shaman. <coughs> Shaman didn't go so hot, but the Paladin went well. And this Rogue is going pretty well. So I think we're going to keep going. I think that's, that's what's going to happen. see how this goes. I've got another uh, Mountain Dew here. Seems to be the way to ensure that I am victorious. Indeed, yes, quite. A little bit laggy there, that's weird. I'm not uploading anything. Usually that's where the lag comes in. <coughs> oh, against a paladin. Oh, I will fight with honor. Oh, and then I get this hand that's just... Oh, that's terrible for going first. I don't want any of these. I've got so many two costs. How is that my starting hand? Better. Definitively better. Not great still though. Well met. Indeed, greetings. The pleasure is mine. How are you today? What are you gonna do? Big bag of nothing. All right. Since you did a big bag enough, and I'm not going to silence anything, I'm just going to hit you. <coughs> no point in silencing, or wasting that silence. It's a very powerful card, especially late game. Drop another, you know, thing. Have hack questing adventure, or drop questing adventure, then silence something else. Reporting for duty. One more recruit, still not worried about it. Alright. <coughs> Here's what we do. Drop the Wolf Rider, you prevent you from having that creature to kill the Wolf Rider, and you for three. Turn four, what do we do? Turn four, if he doesn't kill it, we drop Cold Master to get a card out of it. For the crusade! <sighs> yep. Yep, yep. He's got one mana now. That was probably a oh no, he's gonna light Oh, he's gonna light justice it. That but. I don't have anything that can cost one, so I don't want to play that yet. But I can do this. Silence that. Give me a weapon. Kill that before it does anything to me, and then I've got board control and you're gonna have to spend another Oh thank you. Thank you. You're very nice today. Uh, another card taking care of that. Oh, that's uh, horrifying. Alright, <clears throat> getting rid of that, getting rid of that. What do I do? What do I do? Three and four and... Can't do much. Here's what we're going to do. I'm going to drop the Cult Master to be tempting. So that he'll hopefully run into it and die. Next turn, if he doesn't kill it, we can drop Raid Leader and Perdition's Blade. Follow the rules. Oh, or you could just do that, you jerk. Now you're gonna win Fury and hit me. That's wonderful. Ah, Two card draw out of that. That was that was worth a well played. Well played. Okay, so I've got six. As I said before, we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna go ahead and raid leader, and then we're gonna perdition's blade to kill the warden. Here we I'm gonna hit the Aldor Peacekeeper. Or him. If I hit the Aldor Peacekeeper, it's gonna trade poorly. That's that's about the best deal I can make out of that. Next turn I can Stormwind Champion. And shortly after that, I can hopefully you know get something in Defender of Argus, both of them, which would just be hilarious. You're gonna trade. You're gonna trade this and hit me for one. So like that or I'm going to laugh at you, those are your options. Uh, 
Reporting for duty. Okay. Yeah, I'm still losing in every respect of this game, but I could turn it around. Okay, but not with that. So I'm just going to go ahead and do this, and I'm going to whack him, I think, is the best course of action here, yeah. Job's done. Still hoping that I can get another four cost or less for Defender of Argus to give both of them taunt for a nice power play. Or you could do that and kill him with that and make me very, very spiteful towards you. You butt. We must cleanse the Sunwell. I don't like you at all. Not the slightest. Alright. How do we handle this? That's hilarious. So I played Betrayal, right? Kill both of his other creatures. Because he's just been a jerk to me. So I play a Fen Creeper. And laugh. Ha 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 ha. Yeah, that's good. What you gonna do? You're in silence. And I hate you. Hate you. In response, if I get something that's five cost or less, I'm just gonna um, give it a taunt again and then laugh really, really hard. Okay, well, I've got. Let's see, I. Yeah, it just doesn't work well. Defender of Argus. Now I can play this without much penalty to myself. You gotta be kidding me! Whack him. He's in a bad place now, and he knows it. It's not the most efficient Argus ever, but it's, you know, it's not bad. Let me think. I am ready to learn. Let's see. Well played. Still doesn't stop me. Still doesn't stop me. <laughs> But I'm becoming significantly less comfortable. <laughs> Still gonna have to run someone into it to die. Okay. In response. Mechanic. Trail right there. Haha. -ha. Now you have a 1-1. One, one. Yeah, you have a 1-1. One, one. I'm gonna go ahead and just smack you for one. How do you feel about damn apples, huh? This is still a close game. He's got that true silver champion with and, and card advantage, so he could still very well win this. It really depends on what I draw. Okay. So he's getting net nothing for that, other than getting rid of the creature, he's gonna get rid of that creature, I suspect. He's gonna play Guardian of Kings, that jerk! Reporting for duty. I'm gonna assassinate that. And then I'm going to Here hit him. Maximum value, get a new weapon, and deadly poison. Man. And then I'm top decking and we're praying. That's what we're doing. He's now at a significant advantage on me in every way. I need to draw a Lord of the Arena. I need to draw um, I really need to draw a Lord of the Arena. Another assassinate won't even help me here. He really turned this game around. And now here's his Venture Co Mercenary. Oh, this is not 
look it's yeah I I lose. Well played. That's that's how the cookie crumbles. Alright, well that's the first game of this episode. That's too bad. Anyway. Moving on, as they say. Still three wins, so even if I lose this next game, I mean it's not a bad arena run. It's 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 not great, but it's it's okay. It's at least fifty percent chance of victory or odds in games and victory, so you know. Certainly decent. A warlock. I feel like I have a decent chance so long as I draw one. I just drew very well. Uh, not as well for going first, but I do have that. I don't need this early game. I'm going to keep the Defender of Argus around this time. Hopefully get a power play. Oh, that's not going to help me. Well, at least I have a guaranteed turn two. I've got a very guaranteed turn two. What are you going to do? Good minion. Good turn one minion. No planes. Uh, okay, can't play this yet. So I'm just gonna go ahead and draw a card and get that card draw out there. Adventure Dome Mercenary, I'm sure I'll be playing that later. On, sir. Just, just concede. That's what you want to do. I can tell. I can feel it. I want... I'm Valera Sanguinar. I can, I can feel your desires. Because I'm sexy. I think is, is the logic I'm going with here. Two demons in your hand. I don't like that. I think as far as warlocks go, card draw is kind of just their thing. So, I'm not gonna waste that combo. It's too powerful. So this time I'm just gonna whack for two. One of the biggest things that can hurt warlocks is if you get them down low enough to where they don't want to life tap for um, cards. It can really cripple them. And then oh yeah, deal damage to yourself. Oh god, I love it when you hurt yourself. Oh god, keep doing that, except you know, it practically without all the really powerful creatures. Alright, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm going to trail on this guy so he'll kill his friends. Because I just find that funny. You have two health. And defy his ring leader. And then I'm going to kill you. Giving me a definitive board. And you just took health for that, so I do I feel like I'm doing okay. Ah shoot there, you're a jerk. Well let's see. Oh that was stupid. That was really stupid. Mistakes were made. I was sitting there trying to count crystals up in my head and then I was like okay two here click no oh I really hope that didn't cost me the game oh, I can't do anything this turn I'm just gonna have to let him beat on me there's no other option the bright side though is next turn I can kill that and draw three cards I mean I guess that's okay Assuming he did, he's, assuming he just goes for me, which he probably will. Ready, sir. Okay, yeah, this is gonna go all right. This is gonna be acceptable. We're gonna drop that. Draw three cards. And hope I get a two faster. I'm actually gonna draw four cards because this guy's also gonna give me a card. I'm gonna draw five because he's gonna die too, so. Oh, it's just gorgeous. Well played. Thank you. Oh, 
do I do? I'm gonna deadly poison. So I can take this guy out. He's just gonna have to clear the board if he wants to trade. Which is in my best interest. And the next turn I can maybe some jungle panther dragonling mechanic for some more board control. be terrible. Hmm. The important thing here is, is we're kind of on even footing. He and I. I have more cards than him, surprisingly. I mean, that, that, um, uh, what do you call it? The, I can't, I can look at it. Why Cult Master. Just paid off endlessly well for me. You can do that. I don't like you. But you are giving up your card advantage, which is at least, you know, it's something. It's not what I want, though. Okay, I can. I can do this. I can trail. Okay. Four, then I'll have three for the. Yeah, okay, this is the right. This is the right play. Kill that. Then I'll combo in and eviscerate to kill that. Then I jungle panther. Kill that. I have board control, card advantage, and a stealth minion. Next turn I can play. Dragonling mechanic to the right of this and then give both of them taunt and plus one plus one. I think that's the play. I wonder. To Northrend. Yep, that's the play, alright. He's trying to rush me down, which is his mistake. Yes, me and Mr. Bite. He just doesn't know it's his mistake yet. My seal for Argus. Thank you for five. And now you have two taunts to go through. Next turn, I can play Lord of the Arena Perdition's Blade. The turn after that, I can play, play Fen Creeper and Venture Co. Mercenary, which is just cruel. that. Understandable. I'm going to run into you with the Defender of Argus because he's just a 3-3 and that's a good trade for me. Ah, uh, get behind me. Or you could do that and make me hate you. Hate you forever. Alright, so what I'm going to have to do is run these two into it and then kill that. I'll still have cards on the field. Alternatively, It doesn't really matter. So here's what we do. So Wait. Many options. Yeah. Yeah, no, this is... This is the play. So we Lord of the Arena, right? The gates are open. And we Perdition's Blade, dealing two damage to him. And we can kill him with Mr. Bitey. And I can laugh all the way to dealing six, seven, eight damage to him. And he's still got two taunts to deal with, and he can't kill either of them, because they both have five health. How do you feel about them apples? I would expect not too well. So many possibilities. So many possibilities of how I can kill you. Yes, quite. Mm, indeed. Indeed. Unless he's got a big surprise, I'm pretty sure I've won this game. You can see him sitting there thinking, like, oh man, how do I get out of this? How? So many possibilities. What do I do? I, I just don't know. 
He's got two tones for five health. That's the magic number. I can only do four damage. Do I win? I wonder. You can't really afford the life tap. What would you get from life tapping would help you? Jaraxxus, if you manage to draw him, but I highly doubt that. Behold the might of storm Okay, wind. you can kill one of them. But I still win. Well played. Also, here's why. Another taunt, adventure kill mercenary, and I'm still gonna kill you. Oh! Well played. He just barely beat my attack. Alright, well, there's that. It's so another win. That was, let's see, uh, game two of this episode? Yeah. Yeah, we got four wins, so we're already doing better than 50-50. I'm feeling good with that. Let's go into game three see what happens. I can't even remember what episode of Ultimate Warrior this is. I've been uploading so many of them. See, I think on YouTube right now I'm up to episode nine. It's technically uploaded. They're still private, but... I filmed 10, so is this 11? This might be 11. I am a rogue rouged up rose, so... Rogue, pardon me. Alright. Oh, Druid, this could go... This is kind of going very poorly, so we're gonna drop you and you. I want you for board control. Yes! Oh my gosh, my favorite first turn play. I just could not be happier. Give me that right there. Oh. This is our town scrub. This is our town scrub. No, if you're calling Malfurion a scrub, that's awesome. Wanna blow something up? <laughs> oh well, you're a jerk. One, okay, good one there. That Mad Bomber worked out very well for him, unfortunately. Okay, two mana, two mana, two mana. What can I do? I could Hungry Crab, or I could do this and just kill that. One. Yeah, take that. You're still ahead of me, but take that. Next one's going to be three. I could do a lot of things. That's how he's gonna spend his mana. Okay. Okay. I can I can work with that. I'm going to pick up Emperor Cobra. I think. Smack him for one. It's a little bit as a sync solo card. It's a little bit better than the raid leader, and it's guaranteed to trade pretty well. So it's well, guaranteed to trade for at least you know one. It's it's not gonna trade for nothing. What you gonna do? What you gonna do when I come for you? He doesn't play another creature. You're gonna deal three damage to it. Alright. He's not gonna play a creature, he's just gonna armor up, so I think at this point my option is uh Dragon League Mechanic. And Mr. Bitey, naturally. Yes, my best play. Job's done. Now we let him have it. I've got board control again, and he can kill Mr. Bitey off, but he'll lose his armor, and then I'll just whack into him, so... Maybe not the best thing for him. If he drops a creature, I'm gonna sap it and raid leader, which would be funny as all get out. If he drops a Murloc, I'm gonna hunker and crab it and raid leader, which would be even funnier. Can't touch it. Huh. Ah. I think I'm actually gonna force him to kill this. In the interest of self-preservation. Oh, I could have betrayed. Oh well. 
this isn't the worst play I could have done. There, there are definitely better plays, but it's not the worst play that I could have done. I think the best play would have been Betrayal to get rid of that, and then um, Raid Leader to deal six damage, and then just kind of laugh. That definitely would have been the better play. Oh well. It's too late now. My eyes are open. Healing yourself for three. Okay. You're gonna innervate. Okay, that's that's a little bit terrifying. Ah, uh, get behind me. Alrighty, I don't like that. Okay, take that. You're gonna do damage to that. Feel free. Either way, you're gonna lose your organ. Unless you hit me. Which would be very me to know it. That's fine, because here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna sap your booty bay bodyguard. Okay. I'm gonna betrayal this guy. Give myself a weapon. Kill him. Hit you for eight. That's what you get for not dealing with him. Now he's sitting there going, God almighty, do I have to deal with him. Down two mana. You're not going to be able to do anything, right? Okay, give me card draw. I'm fine with that. I actually greatly prefer that. But I've got eight mana. What am I gonna do? I could. Okay, if I drop Lord of the Arena, he's just gonna kill it. If I drop this, he can't kill it, and then I laugh at him. Yes, I think that's the, I don't think that's the play. And do it. And I draw a card. Yeah, that's the play. All right. Okay. Well, he got rid of that. That's annoying. But oh, you're gonna you are gonna kill it? Okay. That's fine. Because next turn I'm just gonna perdition to it. Let's see. Or I can do that. That'd be funnier. All right. I've got eight. Two, three, five, so I've got three more. So I'm going to. I'm actually going to take the five damage, I think. Yeah, because that way I can kill the Kodo. I can it out. I'm going to drop. The Jungle Panther, yeah? Yeah. Perdition's Blade. And Eviscerate it. You have no creatures. I've got a two-thing weapon and a 4 2 Panther. And next turn I can Lord of the Arena Raid Leader. Unless you drop something that I don't want to attack, in which case I can Frost Elemental Raid Leader. Also a good option. Have to see what happens. What to do? Where shall I strike? You're gonna go for that. Yeah. Or die, or both. Okay. Well, that is unfortunate, isn't it? We are gonna make you. Yeah. Yeah. Now we're just gonna make you a sad person. Yep. I'm gonna make him trade stuff. I don't want to give up that stealth yet. He's gonna have to trade both creatures to get it. They'll have to trade a lot of his health and a creature. All right, I'm fine with that. He's going to trade a lot of his health. He's going to trade six health 
And your taunt? I wouldn't trade your taunt. I think that's a mistake. You're not going to trade. Interesting. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to trail. This guy. That's hilarious. You're gonna get cards out of it, which is you know, not the best thing that I could do, but yeah. I'll hit you there. And I'm going to freeze this guy so he can't kill me. Drop a cold blood, drop a hungry crab, and just wail the hell into you. Actually, I just won, didn't I? Here I did. We go. I'll play well, first. Here we go. All right, game three's a win. Doing well with the rogue. I'm gonna use level 15, so I get a golden card. It's golden sinister strike. Okay, that's fine with me. Five wins, doing good. One more game. Let's see if we get to six. There's one more game, right? So we're at to about seven. I played. Is it? Is that game one or two? Or two or three, I should say. I think this is game three. Because I was at two to one. Now I'm at. How is it? Three to one, now I'm at five to two. No, that was game three, so this is the final game. Not gonna go for Storm and Champion. Alright. The Hunger Crab's a pretty good first turn play. Can't complain. Pretty sure play, alright. Drop him out, get some board control, just right out the gate. What are you going to do? <clears throat> Can you take it down with one mana? Get in there and fight, Maggot! Abuse of Sergeant. Hmm. Yeah, that's a good trade. Slightly preferenced to me. Preferenced? Preferenced to me. Ever so slightly. That's a turn three. I'm probably gonna play the Emperor Cobra, which that won't trade well for, or his unit won't trade well for. I don't have enough men. Like I'm gonna make it even funnier because I'm just gonna kill his unit. I think it'd be hilarious if the Emperor Cobra was like, kill anything attacked by this minion, you just hit the hero and you won. That would be... I'd be a legendary guard, I'm sorry. Okay, you're gonna make me trade. You're gonna make me trade. You butt. That's fine, because I'll get a Morgan Infiltrator. And I'll Perdition's Blade you. I still get a preferential situation out of this. Well played. Thank you. Thank you. Combos are what rogues are all about. Oh, true silver. Ooh, I don't like you. You are a butt. On the bright side, he is not putting out any more creatures, so he's kinda handing me that for free. So here's what I do. I attack for two. I draw this to give him stealth again. Here we go. <clears throat> He's probably gonna hit the Seeker Keeper. I would. It's not a good trade. It's not like a good situation. Oh, or you could do that. Oh, you're a jerk. You're gonna make me kill all that stuff. 
that's okay. Still take two damage from that. I can still kill both your creatures with a betrayal. So that's what I'll do. I will betrayal. First. Kill that. Loot order. Give myself a weapon. Here we go. Wall. Yep. That just happened. He's sitting there like, oh, come on. And he healed himself for four, so I've actually done 11 more damage to him than he has done to me. I hope you like my invention. The downside of fighting someone else healing, you just gotta keep beating them. I don't think healing is good by itself, but Your healing on other cards. Oh, you jerk. You little butt. Fine. Played that well, so my betrayal won't be very useful. <sighs> Here's what we do. Hey, give me that. Yep. Oh. Trade that. New weapon. Deadly poison. Clear the board. Here we go. Job's done. And now he's got a health and a card advantage on me. I do have a three damage weapon, but that's you know that's not saying too much. I think this may be this may very well be the last. Game on this rogue. <clears throat> yep, I'm gonna have to go with this to give me the last. Unless I draw something good, I could draw something awesome. Reporting for duty. Never know. It's not what I was looking for. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna raid here. We're going to hit the taunt. And then we're gonna hit. Come on. We're gonna hit him for three and pray. I guess is really what I got going for me. Uh, yeah, he's gonna, at least he can't kill me outright. It's pretty much the only thing I got going for me right now. He can't kill me outright. Hmm. That is incredibly annoying. Get rid of my Argus. Or he could do that. Attention, class. God. I just wail into me. It doesn't matter. Yeah. That was a mistake. Next. Whatever. It doesn't really matter. Because I'm now all I can do is drag in mechanic and give myself that. I hit you for three. You hit me for eight. Here we go. Next turn, I'll have five, seven, eight damage. I unless I draw a taunt, he's gonna win. That's really what this comes down to. It's probably where I end it. Hmm. Hmm. Indeed. How best to kill this one? Or you could do that and make me completely real. Oh, I am not a morning person. <sighs> Ladies and gentlemen, that card advantage. Alright, can I wipe his board? Not even close. Well, I'm gonna do this because I hate him. I'm gonna do this because we were funny. Then I'm gonna kill myself. Aha! Take that! Kill me! Well played. I will give him the the well value, played. the virtue of killing me. Put this apple on your head. Oh my god, if he knife jugglers to kill me. I'm flying. Okay, 
and I drove her to kill me. It would have been hilarious if he did, but oh my god, how angry would I have been if I died to a knife driver? God. Okay, well, I believe that's eight games on this run, which would mean I have four of this episode. Five and three, yep. Alright, so that's the end, but let's see what I get. A five win key is pretty good. Gold, 5 dust, 40 dust, 30 more gold, and a pack. 60 gold, 45 dust. I can deal with that. Let's see what we get in the pack. An epic! Great, I can help my warlock deck. That can be fun. Alright, what's the epic? Ancient of Lore. Oh, yes! I love that card in Druid decks. Alright, well, that's it for this episode of Ultimate Warrior. Please like, favorite, subscribe, use all your social media and your social media devices to share with your friends and let them know that you love me. And uh, I'll see you next time.